All right, welcome back for part six of Skies of Arcadia Legends. Uh, before we get started here real quick, uh, I do want to let you guys know I did go back and fight uh, Piestol uh, once more, uh, and I did end up recording it. Um, I didn't record any audio to go with it, but I did fast forward it and put a slight commentary over it. So we're going to switch to that real quick so that you can check it out. All right, so... Uh Decided I'd speed this footage up for you uh, so you don't have to watch the entire thing in real time because it took forever. But uh, as you can see, this is kind of like just me going through some battles and leveling up uh, and eventually going back into that battle. I ended up visiting this guy and seeing if maybe visiting him would help uh, in terms of like getting new stuff. So. This is something that uh, we didn't look at before, but basically it just shows that uh, the little girl there lost her mom and dad. And uh, the doc's been taking care of her ever since. Um, and she has not talked in the time that he has known her. And uh, the, the first time she ever talks, she says right here, she says thank you. And then she says thank you again. And um, it's the first time in years that he's heard her talk. And uh, so we basically would give this, you know, the little thing some moonfish. And we hear some backstory about how he was, you know, used to be a doctor for the value and empire for a certain uh, admiral who was the father of this girl. And, you know, and now he's, you know, vowed to take care of her. So that's basically the story there. So he just says to keep getting the uh, the moonfish. The bell is whenever like she uh, needs him, she rings the bell instead of saying, I need help. Um, but now on to more important things. Uh, we, we give her uh, another moonfish. But um, after that, we go and we head towards our foe. Um, I actually did a lot better this time. I actually ended up using some some moon berries to get some of the special um, special effects. Like uh, I got Vice's Counter Strike. I also got uh, Aika's Delta Shield, which helped a lot in terms of any time Piestol used um, Eternai or Webley or whatever. Um, Vina also leveled up, so thankfully uh, she was in much better shape for this fight as well. You'll see everybody survives this time around. Uh, I have Fina pretty much guard the entire time, but she survived and she leveled up. Um, everyone leveled up. So, this is just a very quick uh, look at what happened. Uh, as before, I went straight for the dog first, take care of that first. Um, used some Glyph of Mites. I did buy some of those when I was in uh, Maramba. And, uh,. Yeah, that's about all that really happened. Um, this battle was not as bad as before. Um, Fina, you know, probably got the most hurt, but she was perfectly fine for through the majority of the fight. Um, yeah, other than that, I think uh, overall, I, I felt like if the battle wasn't as bad this time around, it may be because everybody was leveled up and so their, their attack damage was so much more. Um, you know, doing certain attacks would be instead of like, you know, a hundred damage, we're like 300 damage. Um, but I made sure to keep strict, strict policies on everybody to make sure that they would survive the entire thing. Um, but yeah, this time around it worked out much better. Uh, I had a much better outcome. Everybody survived. And, uh,. I don't know, well, yeah, I do know why. I decided to go ahead and use Cutlass Fury instead of waiting to use Tackle because I wanted to use Delta Shield there too. Tempest Dance also did very little damage in terms of, uh, what, before it was like 1,000 or 1,200 damage. And this time around it was only doing about seven or 800 damage, which I was really happy to see. So something to do with leveling up. We added some new equipment. Uh, things like that probably helped out a lot. Uh, so. Just goes to show that, you know, sometimes it's all about just making sure you have the right stuff equipped, maybe buy a couple things, um, and you'll be set. I hope you're liking the chipmunk voices too. They're pretty funny. And the music in super fast speed's pretty interesting. 
Even though I still love it, it's still good. Yeah, that's the only time that Tempest Dance really ever did any significant damage was on Aika for some reason. It was, it was a thousand damage that one time, and I think that was it. I think other than that, it was perfectly fine, and every time it was either eight or seven hundred damage and nothing more. Yep, and Delta Shield came in handy so much, especially near the end, because she kept using Eternai and Webley. Those two, especially, she would use constantly. Tackle... And that was basically the end of it. And this, the same ending as before, obviously. I mean, there's no difference really there. You know, she sees the, that and that's it. So now we'll head back into the other version of this video. All right, now that you've seen that, let's head on in. So I'll be loading from what we saved originally, that second file. But this time it's going to be the second file that I ended up saving over with what you just saw. Where I kicked her ass so hard. All right, but because of that, we're also going to be doing a bit of a shorter episode, too, just because of the content that you just saw combined with now me playing again. So we need to head... West. Are we heading to Yafutoma? Maybe. Let's see if this says anything. The journal. Nope. Nothing. I think we're heading to Yafutoma. I think. I hope I'm right. It's another late night for me. I am a bit of an insomniac. Um, it's about 2.30. So, not quite as late as before. Before it was, what, 3? So, this time it shouldn't be quite as bad, and I shouldn't be getting too tired by <laughs> the time I finish this. I know I've been yawning a lot when I play this. Oh, I get very tired. But it's, it's, it's strange when you're an insomniac because you get tired. You do. But there's nothing you can do to sleep. <laughs> it's like you can be exhausted, but the minute your head hits that pillow, you will not go to sleep. You do not feel like you can sleep. And it's terrible because you're exhausted. And no matter how exhausted you are, it does not hinder your brain's ability to uh, continue to operate at maximum potential or capacity for a human being. Well, that was easy. That was fun. Oh, he got so cute. So by this point, I've release, released uh, two episodes of the of the playthrough. No comments yet on my. <laughs> My mispronunciation of uh, Aika. So I guess I'll just keep doing it. Alright, we can go through here, right? Isn't that what they were saying? We could, we could go through this now? I might be completely wrong. I might be so completely wrong right now. Um, you know what? No, let's just attack normally. And that, and that. Here goes. Here goes. Damn. The powerful attack there. Booyah. Booyah. Well, no, we don't go to Yakutoma yet because that's when Grendel. Yeah, we don't fight Grendel yet. No, block. Look out! So over the top and unnecessary, but so worth it. We did it! And that's without Incrim, too. 
So it's getting up there in terms of the attack power. Oh, we got a Moonberry. I don't think we're getting through here, are we? Nope, we are not. Crap. Oh, man, I'm not paying attention. I don't pay attention. What's wrong with me? Okay. Uh, maybe it was... Was it east? Maybe I needed to head straight east. Let's go straight east. I think I got the... I think I got confused because we got the letter about heading west of Sailor's Island. And I think that confused me. And the fact that it's been a little while and I've completely forgotten what I was supposed to be doing. I'm going to refrain from getting out the strategy guide. I'm going to refrain from doing it. So don't don't complain if I don't figure this out because I am refraining from using a strategy guide. And then if I end up not knowing what I need to do and end up using the strategy guide, don't complain then either because I'm doing you guys a favor by moving the story along so you can see more of it. Do 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 do. Damn. Psh. That was funny. 15 damage. That's nothing. Do 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 do. All right. Yay. <gasps> you learned in creme. Cool. All right. We will head over there to... Uh, Maramba again, and then go straight east and see what we can find. Here we go, back through here. Bam! Alright, what do we got here? I'm gonna go up here. We're gonna pass the temple. So, after that... Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. Alright, I'm gonna give it a few minutes if I can't figure it out. Whoa. Damn. Let's use some, uh... Let's use some magic, guys. Um, let's see here. Do 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 Bam! That's how it's done. That was amazing. Oh, ho, ho, yeah. Bam. You're dead. One more. We got this. Oh, you can't run. Can't run from me, motherfucker. You can't run. You can, you can try, but you will not run away. You know why? This is why. Go get your bite. Bam. <laughs> Do 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 And this is probably good to like get some leveling done as well, so no big deal. Okay. Let's just go straight east. What is that? What was that? Ah, uh, we're gonna have to wait until we get the Delphinus, or Delphinus, however it's pronounced. Alright, well that's just a big border around everything. Okay. I'm sorry, I gotta do this. Um, yeah, let's get that guy. You guys can take care of these. Train! Huh. 
thankfully this train is not being very loud. Let's see here. We're supposed to head south. My bad. We're going to Ixitaka. My bad. Yeah, I think I just I got messed up with the uh, the the new mission of seeing and fighting Piestol, so. Alright, so let's head south. Figures. I'm going the exact opposite direction. All right, here we go. Fine, I won't enjoy the nice, relaxing, and soothing music. See if I care. I'll make my own relaxing, soothing music with blackjack and hookers. So deal with it. Um, let's attack the looper. Loopalon. Jeez! It, it did nothing! Oh, you gotta be kidding me. If that works, I will be so pissed. <laughs> okay. I do not like that move. Eternai, just, ugh, I hate it so much. Bam! You're all dead. So here's an interesting question that has been popping up, uh, or at least popped up for me uh, in my Facebook news feed because of a friend uh, who is a fan of JRPGs. Um, I mean, obviously, this is a JRPG. But, um... The uh, question was raised on whether or not JRPGs are as anticipated or as desired in the U.S. as they once were. And I think that's a pretty hard thing to answer because it seems like there's like Final Fantasy, which people go crazy for even the, in the U.S. There's... Um, like the classics that people go crazy for, like the Skies of Arcadia or like Legend of Dragoon, things like that. Um, but do you guys think that uh, JRPGs are becoming less and less desired in our US culture? Um, and if so, why do you think that is? Do you think it's a cultural difference? Um, or do you think it's something else? I'd like to hear your thoughts on this because it's it's intrigued my thoughts on it. Um, because obviously, you know, my second favorite game of all time is a JRPG. One of my other favorite games of all time is a JRPG, which is Final Fantasy VII. And I love Final Fantasy VIII and I love Final Fantasy IX and I liked Final Fantasy X and... I loved Legend of Dragoon from what I played of it. I never got a chance to play the whole game. It just seems like uh, JRPGs aren't like getting as good of a rap as they should, considering how much they've influenced the uh, gaming uh, world. But maybe that's just me. Who knows? I'm just a Skies of Arcadia fanboy. Booyah! I think it's hard to say that like a Jap just because it's Japanese means that people don't want it. I mean, look at Nintendo, primarily Japanese. People love Nintendo. They love the hell out of Nintendo. Oh, Maroon Isle. I had never found that before. I've never found that one before. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, so that's right. We gotta we gotta get through the uh, the tornadoes here. I forgot about this part. Well, I didn't forget about it. I just didn't think we would be getting to that so soon. 
Oh man. No. No, 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 no. God damn it. Stop it. Stop it. All of you. Stop it. Man, I really wish I had, uh... What's it called? The one where he goes up and, like, throws a bunch of swords down on all, on him, all, all enemies. Uh, Reign of Swords. I really wish I had that right now. Um... Let's switch to purple for these guys, because they look like they're primarily uh, fire-based. Alright. Whoa, you know what? Hang on. I'm going to freaking... Crystallis, these guys. No. Let's super move them. Um, Alpha... Ah, uh, that's a fire-based attack. Alright. And... Alright, let's do this. No! God, I hate how quick they are. Oh, it's so terrible. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Eat it. Yeah, run. Run like the... Like the fucking coward that you are. Oh! Ho, ho. Well done, Cupel. Very nice. That was awesome. Alright, let's get through this. Oh, that's right, there's a short clip. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll be fine. We will be perfectly fine. Oh, we're gonna be fine. I've, I've driven through this hundreds of times. Never once have I gotten caught in the tornado. Not once. Although, how funny would it be that the only time that I do is when I'm recording? Wait a minute. Am I noticing this correctly? In the top right corner there, is it showing what color they are? Therefore giving me the advantage of knowing what color to attack them with? Please don't tell me that I've not noticed this the entire time, every single time I've ever played this game, and then and now it's just coming into play. Holy crap. If I'm wrong, please somebody make a comment about it, because if I am wrong, then then that's going to come back to bite me in the ass. Because I'm totally going to use that right now as as an indication of how to attack these guys. Although I guess it'll show up like, if, if they're in the yellow, then it'll change to yellow in the next turn or whatever. So, let's take a look. Nope, it, they're still green. So, clearly, there's something there. Um, Alright, I don't think that's doing the, the most damage, so let's go with... ...that. Yeah. And then that, and that. <coughs> Get him! Well done, Cupo. No! No! I hate when they do that. That'll replenish his health completely. Mm-hmm. Because that's just how he rolls. All right, Vice. Come on, finish this guy off. Oh, you're kidding. Fine. 
double double super move. Yeah, I know. It was completely pointless, but whatever. We did it. Do 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 do. Ooh, level up. Cool. All right, let's do this. Wow. Okay. I usually don't complain about the random uh, encounters, but that was pretty, pretty crazy. <laughs> that one, I was really unnecessary. I am sure, I'm sure you guys could agree on that one. That one was pretty crazy. All right, let's try to hit a loop along. Shit. <laughs> like that's gonna happen. Yeah, it's gonna do zero on them because they're fire-based. No, 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 no. Oh, you, Joe, you suck. Well, at least they can't kill Fina, right? I hope. That would suck. So this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna do Pyrus, and we're gonna have her try to, whoops, rise in, bring Vice back. And he's gonna do Pyre. Yeah. Bam. God damn, not doing any damage to the fucking Screw you, dude. That's not gonna do a whole lot. Oh god, you're kidding. Really? Zero damage to everyone. I've never seen that happen before. Yeah! Back, bitches. Counter. Darn it. Are you ready for this? Are you ready for this, you stupid Lupalon? All right, let's do this. No, I'm watching it this time. Booyah, 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 boo motherfucking ya. Yeah. You deserved every little bit of that. Goodbye. Don't you even dare. You suck. You really do suck. Alright, you know how we're gonna finish this? Yes, you do. No. If you hit him again, if it works again, oh my god, I will get so upset. Oh. Okay. Yeah, that's right. Can't stop me, dude. Boo, motherfucking yeah. Only 162 damage? That makes no sense. Let us be thankful for our safety. Thanks, Fina. You always know what to say after I've been knocked unconscious. Whoops, wrong thing. Yeah. Let's get him some health here. Alright. Get some sacred crystals out. Are you hearing this? The sound system's not working correctly. <laughs> That's not good. Oh, there, that rock. I gotta get to that rock. I think there's a discovery on it, if I remember correctly. Or wait, no. There's a discovery on one of these rocks. I know that. I know there is. Which rock is it? I forget. I forget which rock. <laughs> no. Oh, you're kidding me. More of these guys? 
It totally shows their co- How? How did I not notice this ever before? How? I am completely befuddled by this. I am an idiot. Holy crap. I am so... I don't... uh, I cannot believe I never noticed that before. Is that in the Dreamcast version? Because if it is, then I never noticed it then either. This is brand new. Like, this is just the first time I've ever seen, like, ever noticed this. I feel like a complete moron. Please tell me I didn't that it wasn't in the Dreamcast one. Like, I, I want it to not be in the Dreamcast version. So that I can feel better. Oh, I'm, I might have to go boot up the Dreamcast one and see. God, if you... Ugh. Please don't. Please don't. God damn it. That's getting real tired. I'm getting real tired of that. Real quick. Okay, next uh, next super move I'm getting is Reign of Swords. Takes 14 uh, points to do it, but god damn it, I need it. Yeah, that's right. Get poisoned, motherfucker. God, everything misses with these guys. Wow. So they're weak against green, but they are green. Let's see. I'm just curious. Do we, what do we have? Sacri. Man, I need a better way of telling the color on him. I don't know which one I'm attacking. No, it's only 56. But that's going to do a whole bunch of damage. So I'm cool with that. 35, so roughly about the same damage you did before. Counter him. Damn. Thankfully, like, their attacks aren't too bad. But it's when they use you turn them over and over again that gets really annoying. And that's pretty annoying, too. It's like all that hard work goes to nothing. Please, uh, oh, counter. There we go, that was a good attack. You're dead. All right, so uh, that didn't really seem to have much of a difference in terms of how it worked. Uh, let's try yellow. I don't know. Um, let's go after him, and we're going to have you bring Ika back. Let's see here. And we're going to get in Krim. Oh my god. I'm getting real sick of your shit. These battles are taking so much longer than they should. Ugh. Counter him. Good job. Bring her back to life. Please work. It didn't work. I hate when it doesn't work. Because it was like a waste of a turn. Oh well. Yeah, we're gonna get him a little stronger and hopefully that'll that'll help. Okay, whoa. You know what? Let's do some Cutlass Fury. Because I'm ready to end this. Alright. Whoops, hang on. Alright, and we'll just have him attack, I guess. 
Yeah, you're done. I'm just, I'm sick of this. <laughs> I don't want to fight you guys anymore. You guys have done enough damage as it is. Alright, doing some good damage here. Counter, counter. Yes! You're dead. That leaves just one. Oh, Ryzen might have been completely pointless. Well, at least we brought her back. And she does get half of her health. So I guess that's something. Okay, you know how we're ending this. You all know how we're ending this every time. Even if it's overkill. Oh, yeah. All right, rank up, electric, cool. Okay, items, sacred. Okay, super move. Yes. Reign of Swords. Alright, let's do this. Now I have Reign of Swords. Don't you dare mess with me now. I will bring you all down so hard. Here we go. Now you get to test out Reign of Swords. Even though I know what it does. I still get to test it out at least. Oh, only four enemies? Uh, let's see here. Incrim. Magic? Oh. I heard Vicious all of a sudden just... Arr! Like, wait, wait, what happened? Did you get hit? It's just off camera. Oh yeah, that's right. Just run. Run like the coward that you are. Yep, we're just gonna have everybody focus. Get this up really high. Do it, man. That's fine. Do it. I don't care. Look at my face. Well, you can't see my face, but I'm not caring. I'm not caring at all. No. I love this move. God, it looks so cool. Bam! Yeah. I just killed you all with one hit. That, was fun. that is so satisfying. That totally just made up for all of the pain and torture of those previous fights. Oh god, that was worth it. That was great. Okay, so I'm gonna go this way. I'm gonna avoid the wall there and get into another fight. Man, by the time we get to Igzataka, it's gonna be at the end of the episode. How eventful, huh? All right, same strategy. Because he does the he has the best attack for these for this kind of stuff. So and then the Lupalon's probably gonna run because he's a coward. No, he attacks. All right, I'm cool with it. Oh, don't you even dare! She's like at full health, dude. Man. That really pisses... Oh, and I'm one point away. Uh, okay. From now on, Increm and Delta Shield. First things first. 
Man, okay. We're gonna attack these guys in the meantime. And hope that we can get her back up with half health at least. Nope. Damn. Now he's blocking. Screw you. Dead. Kill the other one. Good. This is what you get. Booyah. Boo motherfucking yah. That's what you get when you mess with me. Because I'm vice. That wasn't so bad. That wasn't so bad. <sighs> okay. Back in here. Man, I'm really going to have to stock up again. All right, magic droplets, how we doing? All right, oh man. We need so much stuff. Oh, oh, fishies. Come here. All right, I got two. I'm good with that. I'm cool with two. Oh, more fishies. Come here. Before I get into a fight. No, as I said it. Oh, really? You kidding? You have to deal with this? If a single one of them uses Eternum. My god. I, I might lose it. I might. I might completely and utterly lose it. If a single one of these fuckers uses uses uh, Eternum, I'm, I'm, I'll lose it. Nope. Okay, cool. Here we go. Cliff of Might. Block. Block. <laughs> You're smart. God, I see one of those things and I'm like, don't you dare. Don't you even dare. <laughs> yes! Well, good, good, Glyph of Might came first. That's always good. All right, now device. Please go straight device, please. Yes. Totally watching this. Man, that's such an awesome move. I love it. What? He's still alive? Now you're dead. Jeez. Sweet. All right. Fishies! Come here, come here, fishies. Come here, come here, fishies. Yeah! Oh. <laughs> yeah! Oh. That was, that was, that was great. All right. What are you facing now? God damn. Okay. Um. Wow, there's a lot of them. All right, Delta Shield. No attacks. No, no Eternum this time around. Get him. That's right, motherfucker. Magic's not going to do anything. Regardless of whether or not it's it's actual magic or not. Just focus, just keep focusing.
That's right. That's right. Oh yeah. We're really getting into this. Reign of Swords. Delta Shield. And we'll give Vice Glyph of Might. And we'll have uh, Drachma just kind of block and chill. Just in case. <laughs> Bam. Man, if only she'd given me the glyph of might first, I would've been, I would have killed them all. Would have killed them all. But this'll do. Cool. Alright, let's get back to our adventure. Is it over already? I don't know, I kind of feel like this version of it has actually more random encounters than uh, the Dreamcast one. I might be wrong, but it sure feels like it. And I could have sworn it had less. <laughs> like that that was a big selling point is that it had less random encounters. But I don't know, maybe I am forgetting, or maybe I'm just remembering incorrectly. Man. Oh, I don't want to deal with you. I do not want to deal with you. I really don't. Rain of Swords. Um. And then let's attack that one just to be safe. Okay, he's running, so it's not a big deal. Okay. I'm glad I had them blocking. Booyah, motherfuckers! That was fun. Cool. Awesome. Fishies! Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. No! Oh. All right, keep pushing along. Keep pushing along. Oh, ooh, what did I find? The beak rock. All right, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I see leaves. That means I'm getting close. I'm almost there. We're almost there. We're almost to Ixataka. It took long enough. All right, and we're gonna switch to red because these guys are all green. Yes, all of them. And we're gonna focus. Delta shield. Um, focus. Yeah. And we'll give Glyph of Might to Vice. Do -do 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 -do. Boo do do Boo do do Counterattack. Yeah. Damn, Vice, you crazy. Do 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 do. God, that's way too high. Yeah, it's too high for me. I can I can whistle pretty decently, but that's a little too high for me. Can't quite reach that. This should work. But I tried. Can't fault me for not trying. All right, Reign of Swords. Block. Um, why don't you take a Sacred Crystal and block? Oh yeah, you're smart. You're smart to run. Here we go. Boom. Yeah. That's right. Nope, not at all. 
and we're leveling up and everything so it's it's all working out and now that the leaves are coming in and i realize we're getting closer and closer to our destination i'm getting happier and happier man like i said it almost it took just about an entire episode just to travel to our next location that's a bit that's a bit ridiculous to be honest Remember I suggested uh, Game Informer to do a super replay of this, and they said they'd love to if it weren't for the uh, random encounters. And now I understand what they meant. Because I honestly didn't think it was this bad. I really didn't. But I mean, it, it's pretty necessary though, so that you can actually be leveled up enough for, for all of your fights. So it makes sense, but ah, man, it's, it is pretty... It can be a little. It can be a little. Be a little too grindy at times. That is for sure. Still has aged really well. I still love this game. It's just, damn, those encounters can be pretty, pretty intense. Come on! There's so many enemies. I am ready to destroy them all. Give him a sacred crystal soon. Thank you. Alright. Brain of Swords. Um Yeah, we're gonna have to go with that. And block and block. <laughs> They they know it's coming. They know exactly what's gonna happen. Let's try this. I was like, shit, man, he's about to go into overdrive. We need to get out of here now. The ones are like, hey, I keep attacking. <laughs> yeah, dumb. And you just your Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. That's ex my exact reaction there. Yeah, level up. See, that's why it's necessary. <gasps> fishies! Fishies! More fishies! Come here, fishies. Come here, fishies. Oh, direct line. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. We made it. Finally, a cutscene. Progress! <gasps> No, I noticed this already. Oh, here we go. Another story from Aika. Here we go. Story time. Did I'm ready to face that thing right there that's in the in the uh, that's which watching them. <laughs> that's great. That's great. We're almost there. Aye aye. Do 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 do. Whoa, there was a ship somewhere. Ah, here we go. Right over here. Uh, no, not right over here. But there is... Is it here? No, it's not. It's, there, it's up there. I'm just, I'm thinking ahead. There's something I need to discover. There are two th discoveries I need to make in this area, and I'm trying to remember where they're at exactly. Uh, do I really want to deal with you right now? Okay, why not? Let's focus. Tell the shield just in case. Um, nah, let's not worry with the glyph of might thing. Just in case, let's let's use Delta Shield. Hey, that came in handy. Call all the allies you want, man. Because I'm about to attack every single one of you at once. 
counterattack. Booyah. Do, 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 counter. Booyah. You know, I just realized I might be mispronouncing Drachma too. Do you pronounce it Drachma or Drachma? Leave your comment below on what, what you pronounce it as. I like Drachma, I think it sounds better. Alright, let's do this. Let do this, Vice. Let do it. Let do it. Haha. <laughs> yeah. Bam. All of you are dead. Whoo. Yeah. <laughs> it's rather maniacal. Okay, uh, hang on. I'm gonna go up here because I need to discover the pointing man. Where are you at? Where are you at, pointing man? Maybe I can't discover him yet. Alright, well, we'll head over and park our ship and get in. Yeah! See, now this I can whistle. And then the guitar comes in, yeah. good music oh man i get so into it i'm sorry but i just love it it's so good oh no. all right well let's see if we can go and talk to the guy in charge and then i think that will call it for this episode this rather uneventful episode i do agree it there's not a whole lot happened there but hey we finally got over here so good ah I need to get this soundtrack <gasps> Ooh, treasure chest <gasps> moonberry yay I always love spinning while I do this I think it looks more badass Let's go down here. I don't remember how to get to the the main place, so I'm just kind of exploring as usual. This is one of the one of the tracks that I just really get into. <laughs> It really is. It is. It is one of the, those tracks that I just can't. 
I, I just can't avoid it. All right, here we are. Let's talk to the guy. Oh my. Oh boy, shit just got real, yo. Oh boy. Oh, that's right, we get to face uh, De Loco soon too. Man, that guy's face is just so cool. <laughs> it's weird, but damn. So head north, head north, head north. I'm I got I'm gonna remember that. Uh huh. Head north, head north. Say it with me now. Head north. Hmm. All right. All right, we're going to save it here. And that will be it for this episode. As always, thanks for watching. And as always, Vice is all hyped up on sugar now. Which kind of sucks because, you know, we always end these videos and he's like, oh man, I want to keep going. And now you're going to... It's, like it's like a little kid hopped up on sugar and then you tell me he has to go to sleep. And he just doesn't want to, so he's just going to spin around in a few in circles, and that's how this will end. So, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.